Hi everyone, in this tutorial, we're gonna add a download button to our Shopify store. You can have it on any themes that you want, um, they should work. And this is what we're adding here. It should be a download button and you can have an option to have it to your customer only and it should disable the button. So in this one, you can just click on the download button and it should download a zip file or CSV and an audio. And I did have a multiple download already. So you can also change the download name to your store. And the seven or the numbers are just because I downloaded it several times. Um, you can have image file, you can have PDF file and video file. But make sure you are authorized to distribute these files before you distribute it to your customers. In here, you can customize it so you can enable or disable customers only. And you can add, I believe it's only four is the maximum, but you can add several of these sections in any of your page in your Shopify store. To start, we have to go to our Shopify admin store. And in here, we're going to go to online store. And I just added the Dawn team right here. And we're going to click actions and then edit code. And then it will expand our screen. So we're looking for our section folder and we're going to add a new section. And in here, I'm just going to name this one download section. And create a section. And we're going to go to our website and add this code right here. And replace this one. So delete that and control V to paste it here. So control A to highlight and then shift tab to reformat and click save. And next, we're going to look for our GS file. So it's like your global GS file or a team GS file. So it's the main GS file that you have. Every team has different main GS files. So for Dawn, it's global.gs. And we're going to go all the way to the bottom and we're going to grab our code right here and paste it right here. And then we'll just fix it a little bit and click set. And that's it. We'll just have to customize the team and add our files. Let's add a new section and look for download section. And we're going to put it up here so we can see it better. So we're going to add a section. So this one, you can have a choice to change the title or whatever you want. And all we need in here is the link. So to get the link, we have to go to our store. So let's go back all the way. Let me just close this one until you see the settings and click on that one until you find files. And I already downloaded several files here. Um, all you have to do is upload a file and choose the file that you want to download and then click open. And then you just have to copy the link here and then paste it in our team editor. So paste it here. Since I have a PDF file, you have to choose the corresponding file type. So you can have JPEG, PNG, GIF, image, and you can also have PDF file in here and video, audio, CSV file, and zip file. And you can have whatever uh, download name you want. So your customer will not have this weird long download names. So you can have your own and you can just advertise your store. So in here, I'm going to have made for you PDF. And you can also put a different label for your button. So for this, I'm just going to change it to PDF. Now, this is the message that will appear when you enable the customers only. So like it prompts them to like log in or sign in before they can uh, press this button. When you go out from here, when you click the download section, you should be able to enable to customers only. And you can add four of them uh, maximum and you can have it multiple in one page. And that's it, guys. This is easy to do. And let me know if you have any questions. And then don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.